7.30 a.m. here in Milan. I am going to the city to try to get tickets to see the painting, the Cenacolo by Da Vinci. Turns out that they get booked out really quickly, so I'll try to get some cancellation. I clearly didn't do any research. So if you're coming to Milan, make sure you book tickets to see that at least, I think two weeks in advance or something, maybe more. I wouldn't know because I didn't do it. No, no, this should It's not even that early in Sydney, a train station at this time will be packed. There's, there's no one here. Managed to get two tickets, which is how many I needed. So this afternoon we're gonna be seeing the beautiful painting of the Last Supper. Oh, I just think I went the wrong way. Hold on. Hmm. That looks like a train station, but it's not the one I need to go. But I came from here. Very confused. Now, back to the hotel, and then we're all gonna go, the three of us, go explore before the game tonight, which is uh, late. Just had breakfast at a cafe here in this place called Palazzo Reale. Had uh, the standard, a cafe macchiato, and a croissant with cream. Oh, and she just had croissant. No coffee for her. Now we're gonna try to get into the Duomo church, which is just one outside. But there's a huge line. I don't know if that's gonna work. Maybe they'll see her cute face and think, you should go first. Right, make your cutest face. Cute, 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 cute. Six and a half hours later. It's around 6 p.m. Today was a great day, we did a lot of stuff. We went to the city, saw the big cathedral, and then saw the painting of Leonardo da Vinci of the Last Supper. It was good, ate lots of food, naturally. Now, I'm going to buy a hot water bottle for my wife, and very soon, we're going to San Siro Stadium, where the game is going to be at 8.45 tonight. Hot water bottles acquired. So, I'm going to the stadium and I took the wrong train because I'm a genius. So now we're going back to get the right train. Just got out of the station. The game starts in about 10 minutes. It's pretty crazy over here. People everywhere. Police everywhere. Newspaper everywhere. Newspaper everywhere. It is 8.45, the time the game is about to begin. There's so much noise coming out of that stadium. Now entering the broadcast complex, which is where all the trucks are. There are lots of broadcasting trucks over here. Pretty much every broadcasting company in the world that has rights to transmit this game brought a truck. It's incredible. Cables everywhere. In that room over there, they're transmitting the game in 4K. So all the people here, not all the people, but some people here in the area are there to watch the game. I mean, there are TVs everywhere because every truck here has a feed, so. You see these cables? Every broadcasting truck has cables going from their truck to the stadium. Oh, something is happening in there. Real Madrid just scored. Don't know if you can hear. It's loud. Now I'm gonna meet my wife and Amelie outside. Because, yeah, they couldn't come in. I'm the only one who has the credential. We're gonna grab dinner and probably gonna go back to the hotel. I don't know if I wanna wait until the game ends and then get into traffic. This place is as authentic as an Italian restaurant gets. Great food. It's called Cucina Pugliese. If you come near San Siro, Come and check out this place. People at the bar watching the game on a small TV just chanting like crazy. We're walking towards the station to go back to the hotel before the game ends, but I don't think it's gonna end anytime soon because last time I checked, it was 1-1. One, one. Oh my gosh! 
I don't know what just happened. It's really loud in there. I feel like the normal time just ended. And they're about to go into additional time. That's, that's my guess, that's my guess. I mean, you know already when you watch this video because the game will have ended. But I have no idea, I'm outside the stadium. I don't know what the heck's going on.